Have you ever heard about Warlock Dobermans or maybe about King or Goliath Dobermans? All these names are used to describe a stronger and bigger, or better to say, oversized Doberman type. But is it really a thing? Is that really a large type of a purebred Doberman? Or is it just a myth or marketing term created by shady backyard breeders to have better sales? Well, in this video, I will tell you all you need to know about the Warlock Doberman. The term Warlock Doberman originated in 1960s. In this time there was a famous Doberman named Borong the Warlock, who won the AKC championship several times. Borong had many offsprings and his bloodline or Warlock bloodline was quite popular, as it was a guarantee of quality bloodline. But the term Warlock Doberman was quickly abused by backyard breeders who started falsely naming their own dogs as Warlock. Since there was and still is a demand for very big, oversized dogs, many backyard breeders use the term Warlock Doberman for oversized Dobermans, mostly Great Dane or Rottweiler crosses. This way they can sell their crossbreeds for much more money, as it seems it is some kind of a pure, large type of a Doberman. Sometimes they also use the term King or Goliath Doberman, but most of the time it's just a Great Dane Doberman or Rottweiler Doberman cross. Funny thing is that many people who want the Warlock Doberman actually think that it is the better version of Doberman. Stronger, more muscular guarding breed that is more valuable. And even though sometimes bigger things can be better, it's definitely not this case. The classic Doberman is just perfectly sized for its main utilization, which is guarding. They are the perfect balance of strength, but also athleticism and agility. The standard height of Doberman is up to 28 inches, which is 72 centimeters. When the dog exceeds this height, they begin to lose their great speed, athleticism and maneuverability, which are all as important traits as the strength. The standard Doberman is just one of the best guarding dogs on the planet and adding size to it does not make it better, so there is actually no reason to breed larger version of this amazing breed. I think that it's better to stay away from puppies that are advertised as Warlock, King or Goliath Dobermans. If you want a Doberman, buy one from reputable breeder. If you want a Doberman Great Dane mix, buy one from someone who clearly say that it is a mix or that calls his dogs Dober Danes or something like that. Even the Doberman Pincher Club of America literally states on its website that Warlock Doberman is a gimmick used to sell puppies and no reputable breeder would ever advertise their Dobermans as Warlock. Tell me in comments if you have experiences with oversized Dobermans and what do you think about this all Warlock Doberman marketing. If you are new on this channel consider subscribing, turn the notifications on and check the Rockadox links in description. Thank you for watching, see you in the next video.